25 disturbing things found on Google Maps. Well, in this day of age, there is hardly a corner of our magnificent planet left unseen by technological eyes, and no company has made their name mapping the Earth like Google. Where there are roads, there is Google Street View. For the rest, Google Earth reigns supreme. But with such thorough exploration, sometimes comes unpleasant discoveries. They can range from anything like something murderous, something really perverted that I really can't talk about on this channel. Regardless, here are 25 disturbing things found on Google Maps. Let's begin, shall we? We are currently giving away an iPhone 7 Plus and 30 Google Play cards and 30 iTunes cards. Now, if you want to be entered into this giveaway, make sure you subscribe right now, leave a like on this video, and comment down below your favorite part of the video. If you are not subscribed, guys, you cannot be entered, so press that subscribe button right now and smash a like on this video. Also guys, make sure you turn on notifications right now, that little bell next to the subscribe button. If you do, you will be entered into our giveaway, and it will give you a huge chance of winning. Number 25, Horse Eating Trash. Anyone with even rudimentary knowledge of horses could tell you that they have a delicate digestive system. They can't vomit, you know, short story. If they eat the wrong kind of food, they can easily die. So seeing the one in this photo captured by a Google card desperately digging through the trash is unsettling at best. Plus, what's going on with its head and neck? Talk about a creepy camera malfunction. Number 24, be gone, Gumby! Let's start with the obvious question here. What is that person doing dressed up as Gumby and why is he following a couple of kids around? It almost looks like the boy in blue is pointing a gun at the costume weirdo, which we could almost understand. Then we got the fact that the other boy is wearing sneakers, so where did he get the sandal he's throwing at the creep? Eh, these are all questions for another time. You know, this kind of reminds me of Stephen King's It, but I think Gumby's a little more terrifying. You'll float down here too, misters. Number 23, Horse Head. It's unclear whether this person was randomly wearing a horse mask while eating a banana on the side of the road or waiting for an equally awkward date. Either way, it's beyond bizarre. Anyone brave enough to actually sit in that empty seat deserves a medal. But hey, at least he set up that fancy tablecloth and let's get started on the flamingos. For another part of the internet, you're probably looking at this picture and thinking, I love it! Number 22, Wonky Legs. This picture of a woman captured in front of what looks like some sort of Mayan temple is all sorts of unsettling. Most people think her legs are the result of a camera malfunction, but what's up with her eyes? And why does her face look so pointed? There are a few people who argue that she looks like something completely out of this world. She does look pretty alien. Maybe a bit like a werewolf in uh, mid-transformation. What do you think, this is an innocent camera issue or just one creepy lady? Number 21, the Pigeon Mob. Okay, now these guys had to have been waiting for the Google car. Why else would they be wearing pigeon masks looking like they're about to drop the hottest album of 2018? We can at least admire the dedication and coordination that must have gone into a stunt like this. Even if we are afraid to click the arrow and walk through them. Number 20, seeing double. This photo is either a perfectly timed double exposure or one serious glitch in the matrix. Aside from a small mistake in the sidewalk, the picture looks like nothing less than two old men walking down the street wearing exactly the same thing down to their hats. Maybe they're buddies and they just like the match? Eh, we can only hope. Number 19, Pentagram in Kazakhstan. People who saw this image of a 1200 foot pentagram etched into the dirt of a remote part of Kazakhstan naturally assumed it had some sort of religious significance. However, as it turned out, it was just a simple outline of a park along the edge of a waterway. That's one odd place for a park in an even odder shape. Number 18, Dead Donkey. These two photos had people all over the world freaking out. If you follow the arrows, it actually looks like a Google car has run over a donkey. Google claims the pictures were actually taken in reverse, as in the donkey was just having a nice roll in the road and moved when the car went by. If that was the case, then why weren't the photos put up in the correct order? We're watching you, Google. Or are you watching us? Is anyone watching us? Are we alone in the world? Okay, time to draw the shades up. I'm starting to taste copper. Number 17, Trunk Bed. What in the name of Wild Wild West is going on in this Google Street View capture? First of all, what is up with the naked guy getting out of the trunk of a car? Is it his car? Was he kidnapped or did he just have one heck of a night out? Why is there a weird buttless dog laying in the driveway when nothing else looks... Yeah, man, what is with this picture? Is the dog even still alive? The world may never know, but I want my answers! I'm so curious! Number 16, Big Bunny. This giant pink buddy in Italy can be seen from the comfort of your own home via the power of Google Earth, and it's all kinds of creepy. The ridiculously large rabbit is apparently a 200 foot long, 20 feet deep knitted sculpture that was created just for the heck of it. 
People are not only allowed, but encouraged to walk around it, climb its sides like a mountain, and even take a nap on the colossal cotton tail. I'd like to meet the person who could actually fall asleep on that wide, gaping face without, uh, having nightmares for the rest of your life. Number 15, Haunted House. This Google Street view of a neighborhood in Baltimore, New York looks like something straight out of Silent Hill. Buildings look like they're trying to melt off the image like wax down a candle. Google claims it was a camera issue that caused the entire street to look monstrous. They have since retaken the photos, but that begs the question of why such obviously messed up versions were allowed to go online in the first place. Sad to see that much like the PT Silent Hills demo, these pictures were taken off way too early. Number 14, Masked Gangsters. It's hard to tell if this group was waiting for the Google car specifically or just a car to hijack. There's something decidedly uncomfortable about people hiding their face behind a mask. Are they heading for a costume party or planning a murder? Without facial expressions, it's hard to tell. Number 13, Creepy Tiki. I imagine the first person to find this bony, demonic looking figure standing on a balcony was quite unsettling. Some people think it's clearly just a tiki statue, while others insist it looks more like something from beyond the grave. Whatever it is, it's downright creepy, and we can all be happier now that Google has blurred the image out. Number 12, a kidnapping. This is just some nice guy trying to help that girl stand up, right? Right? Well, apparently Google Maps captured kidnapping in progress, and possibly with two guys involved. It's hard to tell if the man standing by the trunk is an accomplice or a surprised bystander. The question remains, why didn't the Google driver stop to help? We certainly hope they at least called the cops, or maybe they were too busy mapping out roads to care. Number 11, Abandoned Baby. We really, 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 really hope this one is just a doll. Abandoning a baby is unfathomable for most people, but dumping one at a Gucci store while you go into shop is just plain disturbing. The sidewalk is not a daycare. There are a million things that could go wrong. Learn that, parents. Eh, hopefully someone actually stopped to help the poor kid. He's probably just looking for his mom or maybe an ice cream cone. Number 10, message on the roof. The spray painted message on the roof of this building might as well belong in a horror movie. While we're at it, let's put a little girl waving while she smiles up at anyone flying overhead. Who writes that kind of thing and why on a roof where no one is going to see it? I mean, I guess we're all seeing it now, even if we wish we hadn't. Number nine, guy in the trash. This one is creepy just because it looks like he shouldn't be able to fit in there. Seriously, how did he shove himself in there and what is he trying to prove? Is he making a statement? Did he get murdered? We just don't know or why he's so unnaturally stuffed in there. For all we know, he could be taking a very uncomfortable nap or he could be a severed head. Hard to say. Number eight, gun at Google. Driving around taking pictures of places hardly seems like a dangerous job. Maybe you get into an accident or two if you're not careful, but apparently you could also get shot at. Some people just like their privacy, I guess, and these men on their front porch happen to fall into that category. What exactly are they hiding in that house that they feel the need to point a gun at someone taking pictures? Maybe we need a SWAT team here. Number seven, plane crash. This looks like a pretty serious plane crash captured on Google satellite. Are the passengers okay? Did the pilot make it out alive? But don't worry, while the image may be hard to look at, this crash is actually just a ghost image of a set from the hit TV series, Trauma. I guess the since canceled show will live on, until Google takes new pictures, that is. Number six, guy in a gas mask. This could almost have been a beautiful picture of the edge of a forest, but apparently some guy thought it would be nice to just chill on the side of the road in a gas mask. I bet he gave the driver one heck of a fright. He certainly creeped us out. Number five, a murder scene. Is it a trail of blood or a wet dog? That is the question, and a morbid one at that. Pursuers of Google Earth have stumbled across what looks like a murder scene on a lake in the Netherlands. New evidence claimed that the so-called trail of blood is actually a water trail made by a dog named Tama, but not everyone is convinced. Either way, it's still creepy. Number four, injured cow. This poor cow was immortalized by Google in what may have been its final moments of life. Was it just dehydration along this lonely desert road, or did something more sinister happen? There does appear to be quite a bit of blood on the side of the road that the cow is facing. It could almost be a slaughter, except there isn't another human being or any other animal to be seen. Unless, of course, the Google car hit the cow. Seriously, Google, stop hitting animals. It's not cool. Number three, accidents happen. All it takes is a single moment for a life to change forever. A Google car captured one of these moments when it took a photo of a young man who had just completely wrecked his car. The image clearly shows he's in distress and possibly injured. Though it's not clear what exactly he hit on such an empty road that could have caused that much damage. Number two, tyrant toddlers. If parents aren't leaving their kids outside of stores, then they're letting them run wild. 
We can certainly hope the guns in this Google Street View image are fake, or those are some really irresponsible parents. The guy who might be about to have his head blown off doesn't seem too concerned, at least. Number one! Bodies in the trash. What in the... How in the... Who does this and why did they have so many mannequins? We seriously hope this was a theater and not some sicko who pulled the shrine out of his apartment or something. This is what nightmares are made of and I'm sure the garbage man who picked these up had plenty. And that's been 25 disturbing things found on Google Maps. Which one was your favorite and do you know of any we missed or maybe you found some creepy locations? Tell us about it in the comments and make sure to like and subscribe for more videos like this one. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all future content from this channel. We hope to see you again soon and thanks for watching as I'm signing out.